Does having perfect polar alignment really matter? Well, today we're going to find out. Okay, so I ran into the polar alignment routine and it actually wasn't that bad. Last night I got it to under one arc minute and it's gone to just under seven arc minutes, so above the five minutes recommended. And so we'll see if it does still maintain really accurate guiding like it typically does when I have it accurately polar aligned. Typically I get between 0.5 and 0.9 guiding out here in the Bortle 5 skies. It's very clear tonight, so that won't affect it. So we'll see, does having a perfectly accurate polar alignment really make a difference or not? All right, so it's the next morning and we got pretty good results. The guiding was between 0.5 and 0.6 for most of the night. We got 1.85 stars on the Veil Nebula through the HA filter, which is really good for this setup, very pinpoint. And so the moral of the story is, you're gonna get good results with auto guiding. As long as the polar alignment's in the ballpark, there's no need to obsess over every arc second. So hopefully that helps. Stay tuned for more tips going forward and thank you for watching Dark Rangers Inc.